once again, another sporting event shows how ignorant people are when they speak on sports. Boxing is one of the audiences of the stupidest views you can ever hear. The stupidest. Have people who talk about boxing, they don't follow it, they don't watch it. Two days before a big fight, all of a sudden they're experts. They watched highlights. They watch a boxing match and they don't know how to score it. They don't understand technique. They don't understand defense. But if somebody gets a big hit or bloodies the other person, oh, that means they won. One person has a big round. Oh, that means they won. That's not how you determine a winner in boxing. You, you score who won rounds. Tyson Fury was robbed. In the first round of this fight, I gave it to Usyk. But rounds two, three, four, five, six went to Fury. Round seven Us went to Usyk. Round eight went to Fury. Round nine went to Usyk. Round nine is when Usyk rocked him. The next round, Usyk didn't do anything. Fury wins the 10th. Fury wins the 11th. And then you get to the 12th round, which you can give to either one. If you want to give that to Usyk, fine. Fury won more rounds. If you're scoring, Fury won the fight. Usyk was not dominating. Usyk was not comfortable for most of this fight. Fury was peppering him. He used his reach. He was sticking and moving in the fourth round. In the fifth round, body shots. Tenth round, bunch of good shots. He and, and then um, you know, in the seventh round, Usyk did crack him good. And I gave him the seventh. He cracked him good. In the eighth round. Fury wins, and the ninth is when Usyk, you know, battered him against the ropes. Usyk had two dominant rounds. Two dominant rounds. He won, I have Usyk winning one, two, three, maybe four rounds of the fight. He did not win the fight. And then all of a sudden, in, in every comment section, th this is another thing about quote-unquote boxing fans. They jump dick to dick to dick. All of a sudden, everyone hates Tyson Fury now. Well, when did that happen? All of a sudden, all of a sudden, all you people is supporting a U uh, the Ukraine heavyweight who's a cruiserweight? Since when? This is, what, this is what I always talk about on this channel. People hop on bandwagons immediately. All of a sudden, uh, Tyson Fury's a hypocrite. How? Uh, Tyson Fury, got he got destroyed. How? He lost one round really bad. He won the majority of the rest of the rounds. This is why I, this is why, this is why, this is why I do not watch other channels. This is why I do not listen to people because they never know what they're talking about. Oh, you have these videos, Usyk destroyed Fury. How? He beat him up very well in one round. The next exact round, Fury wins that round. Usyk didn't do anything the rest of the fight. <laughs> it is just amazing. It is amazing. Usyk, in the fifth and sixth round, Usyk looked like he was, he was a little fatigued. He, he looked like he was throwing pillows out there. He was looking for a low blow to be called. This is, this is ridiculous. Now, I said in my previous video, I could see how it could be a tie. But then it's like, no, no. Fury just edged the win. It wasn't a dominating Fury win, but Fury won the fight if you know how to score boxing. But, you know, you have a bunch of delusional drunkards who get emotional and oh uh, the the big moment of the fight he he was hitting him and now I'm excited and and yeah all of a sudden I don't like fury <laughs> all of a sudden oh fury he he's a luciferian he's a cheater and he's a he's a scoundrel he he's a dosa he's beat nobody hit the like button man I'm eating off these monkeys. <laughs> the rematch will happen and fury will definitely win clear
next time. He won clear to me. I was scoring this fight. I understand the game of boxing. Usyk looked very frustrated for most of the fight. And then he cracked a little bit of a code toward that 7th, 8th uh, uh, round. 7th, 8th, nine. He cracked a little bit of a code. And, um... I, I, it's, it's like this weird agenda. And then, this is the, the internet weirdo nonsense. You have these people who don't know what they're talking about, who, who have this uh, uh, exciting anxiety in their chest, and, and they go on every channel, every single channel. Oh, you, you said you said Fury was robbed. What are you smoking? Um, I don't smoke. But clearly you lick dick. The, the people, people clearly, you're a bunch of dick lickers. Because now you're going video to video telling people, what are you talking about? You don't know boxing. You don't know boxing because you can't explain why Usyk won. You do not win a fight because you beat someone against the ropes for one round and it's called a knockdown. Okay, great. That was a great round. It was the best round of the fight. Great. But in boxing, you score the fight. Boxing is not determined off of one moment or one round or two rounds. Because, like I said in my last video, if that's the case, then that means Wilder beat Fury in their first fight because Wilder knocked him down twice, clearly. So I guess Deontay Wilder beat uh, Fury the first fight. Yeah, I, I guess that happened. Oh, I, I okay, then. I guess may, maybe, uh, I mean, please. The, oh. <laughs> Hit the like button. Share this video. Subscribe to the channel. You know, Usyk... He he screams heavyweight to me. I mean he screams cruiserweight to me because he really is one, but um the the rematch will happen. But I wonder if um well I I believe the rematch ha the rematch has to happen before uh, Usyk can fight Joshua. Uh, why is Anthony Joshua getting another shot? I, I'm sick of him. Get get somebody else in there. Anyway, but um you know. What's done is done, and what happened happened. Uh, Usyk is definitely a good fighter. He was getting. He was. He was clearly losing the losing a lot of the rounds in the fight, and he lost his fight. But he is a good fighter, and he stayed in there, and he kept going, and then he did crack a bit of a code. But then, right after that explosive round, he did nothing the next round, and then Fury won. Fury won the tenth and eleventh. Fury won more rounds in his fight, and if you're scoring on the ten nine ten eight, Fury won. But um, you know, like I said, uh, what's happened has happened, and uh. It's just the it's just the real story is these delusional people called fans, a bunch of man worshippers. All of a sudden, there's this anti fury agenda. It's just amazing. Or the same thing with Devin Haney. Nobody hated Devin Haney, but as soon as he gets cheated by Garcia, oh, now we don't like Devin Haney. <laughs> Why? It, it's amazing. I, I can't wait for the first time Tank Davis loses. All them man worshippers. When Tank Davis finally loses, what are they going to say? <laughs> it, it, it is it is just it is it's incredible these same people oh uh, canelo's canelo's overrated Th these same people bud crawford's gonna lose and then when bud crawford beats spence oh uh 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 uh, 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 uh boots Ennis could beat crawford oh my god <laughs> it just it just these people, they know nothing about anything they talk about. I don't know what it is about people who talk sports. They don't know what they're talking about. You got people with Caitlin Clark. Oh, uh, Caitlin Clark is a bust. How? She's played three games. Oh, she's a bust. How come her shot's not falling? Because this ain't college? Because the, the WNBA three-point line is further back? Because she has to adjust to playing against grown women? No, no, she's a bus, bro. No, bro. If you compare her to Jordan and Bird and Magic in their first game, oh my God, she's a bus, bro. These is the idiots on the internet. Know nothing about sports. Everything is this at the moment, prisoner of the moment. <laughs> and then as soon as, you know what happened? You, you know what's going to happen? When, if Fury takes another fight before Usyk or whatever the case, if Fury beats Usyk in the rematch, then what are you people going to say? Oh, Usyk's a bomb. Oh, he was a fraud. You know what? They were right. Fury did get robbed. <laughs> it never ends. But I'm going to eat off these carcasses. Check out my latest content. Is Ric Flair still drunk, wooing in a blind woman's face? F Ric Flair is going crazy. 
I'm, I think Flair might be up out of here real soon. I think he should be in prison with Puff Daddy and Suge Knight, but <laughs> well, that's another video for another day. Uh, I'm up out of here. Like, share, comment, subscribe. You can donate to the Cash App if you support the channel. A lot of people, they ask like questions or they ask for requested videos. Donate to the Cash App and type in the video you want. It's that simple. I don't understand people who don't get this. And uh, I'm up out of here.